In this video, I'm going to explain what size you can use in Procreate for posters. Welcome to Stave Draws. I'm Stave, a Dutch illustrator and animator. I got a great question from Sophia. Hello Steve, I'm enjoying your videos on the exhibition. I'm curious as to why you choose 72 dpi for the painting. I have been told that 300 dpi was necessary for professional prints, but it looks like your poster print was quite clear. Can you help me to understand how the 72 dpi worked well for the print? I'm learning to paint in Procreate and hope to print in the future, so I'm eager to learn and understand DPI and other settings for good printing resolutions. Cheers, Sophia. Here I have some of uh, the prints or the paintings I did in Procreate and um, when you check them out, uh, you can do that by pressing on Actions and then on Canvas and Canvas Information. And here you see the information of how long you've worked on uh, the project, but that's not really important. Uh, you see the pixel dimension and the physical dimensions. And the physical dimensions are 1764 millimeters by 2505 millimeters. And that really doesn't matter. Uh, and I'll explain later. The actual dimensions of this canvas are the pixel dimensions and those are 5000 by 7100 pixels. And I will just explain uh, by opening up uh, a new canvas in Procreate and you can do that by pressing on the plus sign and then underneath you can press on create custom size. Here you can uh, fill out what kind of metric you want to use and just for the example I'm just gonna use millimeters and the prints I used in uh, the exhibitions are at A0 size and A0 size is 841 millimeters by 1189 millimeters at 300 dpi so I'm just gonna fill these in and it's 841 millimeters by 1189 and then at 300 dpi and that's the problem with procreate you know there is a size limit because here you can see it is too large and I made a lot of other posters also to use for my red bubble page and I'll leave a link in the description box down below and there you can you know uh, create art and they will be printed digital and there is a difference between digital printing and offset printing offset printing uh, is done most of the time for uh, magazines and books and you know with big quantities but you know for a poster sometimes you just need one poster so for digital, you can also use 150 uh, dpi and it will still look good uh, in print. So I'm going to change the 300 dpi to 150 dpi. And there you see that Procreate uh, can make uh, an image uh, as big as this. Uh, the maximum layers are 11 so you only have 11 layers the bigger the file uh, the less layers you have to work with so you can just uh, tap on create and then you create it uh, an a0 size poster uh, at 150 dpi and you can check it also uh, when you tap on actions go to canvas information you can see here the physical dimensions and physical they mean by paper that's 841 millimeters by 1189 millimeters and the pixel dimensions are the real dimensions of your canvas and these are 4967 pixels by 7022 pixels the reason why I um, created a, a canvas uh, at 5000 by 7100 pixels is because I also make a lot of art 
that I sell on Redbubble. And 5,000 by 7,100 is uh, almost uh, the same um, as the biggest size you can print. It's not the biggest size, but it is the biggest size I can work in in Procreate. And 5,000 pixels by 7,100 pixels uh, are uh, the biggest sizes I can work in and uh, still get a great result in the prints on uh, Redbubble. And another reason for uh, using uh, a little bit of a bigger size, because when you go back to uh, this uh, file, you can see that there is a little bit, little bit of a difference because the pixel dimensions for 8.0 size. So I printed everything on uh, a zero size and a zero size is uh, in physical dimension, it's 84 millimeter by 11, 8, 9 millimeter at 300 DPI. But, you know, that you can't uh, use in Procreate because it, uh, uh, the canvas has a limit. When you do the same thing at uh, 80 uh, size, 841 millimeters by 1189 millimeters at 150 DPI, then your uh, pixel dimensions, uh, that's the canvas you're working in, are 4,009 six seven pixels by seven thousand twenty two pixels and then you have eleven layers to work with it's not a lot of layers but you know you cannot make a bigger canvas at uh, the same aspect ratio the reason why i work uh, at uh, the five thousand by 7,100 pixels is because I then have something of a bleed. And a bleed, if you have a canvas, let's say that this is an A0 size paper. And if you want to print a poster without white borders, then you need a bleed of three millimeters on each side. So you have to have three millimeters on this side, on this side, on this side, and on this side. And that's why I decided to work at 5,000 pixels by 7,100 pixels. So you still have, when you uh, export it to Photoshop on your Mac um, or on your uh, PC, you can import uh, this file uh, and then you still have uh, some bleed you can overlap and then you can send it to your printer and then they will cut off the bleed and they print on a bigger size paper and then they just cut off the three millimeters on each side of your poster. And that's why I'm using 5000 by 7100. It's great for to send it to a printer in your neighborhood or to use it for your red bubble art you want to sell on red bubble. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you want me to do more videos like this, please let me know in the comments down below. Drawing is fun and practice makes perfect. See you next time. Doodles!